Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we had, uh, just come back home to deal with some inventory once again. Uh, again, dropped down pretty far. And Where now we're going to, to head over to Markarth Climbing back to we'll start that little quest I alluded to in the last two episodes and then never did. Because Ever been to dragons and Let's then say, bandits the and dying and going insane and, you know, just all the fun stuff. You understand. You understand. Anyway, there are always human cattle in Castle Volokar that any vampire can feed upon. And I pronounced it wrong. It's Volkehar. Ugh. This is a morning for me. A really weird morning. Because my car broke down yesterday. And everything that day just gave me the finger and said, Fuck you, you motherfucker. It's just... It's just a whole thing. Don't worry about it, I got it handled. But Jesus fucking Christ. Anyway, now we're going to deal with the quest here. What happened to you? The force won't have it's not with this mine. mine. We're the only Just because left. the people who came back are at this mine. You two head inside and get some rest. I'll send word to the Yarl. Don't fun doing that. Damn force worn. Only a matter of time before they hit here too. Uh, what's this all about, force worn? Seems Cole Skager mine got hit by force worn. Those madmen get more bold every season. Oh, shit. Pavo and Gat are the only survivors. I'll be sending word to the Jarl about this. But I don't know when help will come. What if I could take care of them? I'm sure Pavo would be grateful. And we'd all rest a little easier. But that's nonsense. You can't handle a group of Forsworn by yourself. If their axes don't get you. Their magic will. Oh, I'm sure I can take care of them. Don't okay. you worry about it. Skaggy, Scarface. Skaggy? <laughs> like Shaggy. <laughs> that Skoggy, I couldn't really read the A there. I guess that is early morning for me. I'm tired and exhausted and half drunk. Okay. Uh, okay, is there someone? Sometimes we, uh... Little caravan from the Khajiit is here, but it's not. So, boo. I wanted to see them. That'd have perked up my day immensely. But, I guess not. It's not meant to happen. Oh well. Blocking with a shield or weapon will recoil an attack and stagger the attacker. Well, bam. <laughs> The speech skill is used to get better prices from merchants and persuade, intimidate, or even bribe others. Alright, here we are. Oh, I'll pick these up. I guess I missed them on my first way around. And now we'll just carve through the Force Warren. And in the meantime, we'll pick up a whole bunch of gold ore. Because that is pretty much what this whole mine consists of. Uh... Yep, there we go. Cool Skegger mine. And then we'll just use that smelter outside and get it all melted down. And then using all that gold, we will be raising our smithing, well, my smithing, exponentially. Because jewelry always increases it by a lot. Okay. I think I'll switch the crossbow here. And... Fire breath, that'd be nice. Huh? Yep, that staggered her. That's good. That was what I was hoping. Well, shit. She dodged that. Didn't expect that at all. Okay. I'll take that, even though I won't use it. I'll sell it later. I always say that. I always say I'm going to sell it later. Then I forget. Then I look like an idiot. 
Okay. They already know I'm here, so I don't know why I'm hiding. But. Okay, I got the Briar Heart a little bit. Looter a lot of bit. Just, I basically have to wait for them to come around, then I can start attacking more in earnest. Because, uh, with them all right there, it'll make it very difficult. <laughs> They're just sitting there, too. Am I? You don't seem to be moving much. I'll make you pay. <laughs> They, they look like they're hitting something pathing. That that one's coming. You won't leave here alone. Down you go, buddy. That was quick. Take that. Well, if you come any closer, I can definitely kill you. Come on, peek around the corner. Me of my cousin's cat. Kill that too. You can throw all the races for marks you want. I'll kill you back. Oh, Damn you! You can't Ooh, that went down quick. Frame rate died a little bit there. But hey, works. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Holy shit, my uh guy's running around like it's freaking crazy town. Okay. Um Got a healing potion. I got a bunch of healing potions, so that should help me a little bit. By a bunch, I mean only those. What the hell? I could have sworn. God damn it, I forgot to do the whole running around thing, I guess. God damn it. Um, do the minor stamina. And. Just, yeah, uh, Ice Wraith Essence should help me a little bit. Come on, damn it. Okay, that's really killing me. The arrow's really not helping either. Um, do the healing and health. And Briar Heart's down. That was the worst threat. And now we just have to kill the rest. Cool beans. Whew. Okay. Now I'll actually do all the goddamn things after I get all of this stuff. Alright. Last dagger there. That's all good. Nothing really good on them. Alright. We are good. And I have a bunch of pickaxes, so I don't need to pick any more up. Which is good. At least I think it's good. Hey! That's one less potion we have to get. And, hey, that's another. Take that. The tomato. So I can use that in cooking. Once I loot all these knapsacks, because I think there's three total in this whole place? I think there's about three. There's that one there, and then there's that one on that shelf. Ooh, another one. Cool beans. I'll take that because I'm collecting the Wolf Queen for this particular playthrough. And then once we get them all, we'll read them all individually at the same time. We'll commit an entire episode to it. If my brain can handle it. Which I doubt it will. And th hmm, I thought the third one was over here. I guess it might be up over here. Maybe. Maybe? Like I said, I, I think there is. I'm not entirely sure. Nope. There's only two knapsacks. Hmm. I must be thinking of something else. Anyway, we'll start here with the stuff that's on the ground. Well, on the table, more like. And I'm going to keep getting those notifications, aren't I? Uh, I'm gonna turn that off because <laughs> I don't need that. All right. Oh, it's gonna do that no matter what. God damn it. Oh boy. Well, get used to that. Motherfucker. We're gonna be able to do that quest like tenfold at this point. All the gold ore I'll be picking up here. Yep, sorry, I was bending over to pick up my drink. Before you ask, no, it's not booze. Just a soda. 
I wish it was booze, but don't need that right now. Like I said, it's the morning. If I'm drinking booze in the early morning, you know I hit rock bottom. Hey, I picked up a diamond. Cool. Can use that in the jewelry making. This is going to be really slow if I keep doing it this way. <clears throat> so. Let's do it one of the quicker ways, if I can. Hold the pickaxe in the hand. And just slam on the trigger. And just collect them all up in one go. We can do that, right? I mean, I could do the dual wielding, but in all practicality for something like this, it doesn't make it any faster. So I just do this. There we go. This is much quicker. Holy shit. I should have been doing this. Whoop. That actually drained the whole thing. Oopsie. I didn't know that. All together, I should end up with 72 bits of ore. So, if I missed any... No, wait, it's not 72. It's like 54, I think. I'm thinking of something else. Pretty sure it's a mine with iron. Or something like that. There we go, okay. And there's a couple over here, I'm sure of that. And quickly. And one more. There we go. And I overdid that. Because I was trying to be quick. I think there's a little pocket one, pocket of one, over at the far end here, just go through the uh, little hole here, then it's right to your left, there we go, and we can just keep holding the trigger down, just keep doing this. It's a little monotonous, but it's a lot quicker than the other one. And if you guys didn't know that, hey, now you know. And if you did know that, well, good on you. You're smart for figuring that out. <laughs> and I know it's a high number. I'm not sure if it's 72 or 54. Uh, let's see. I click gold. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 54. Because I had one before I came in here. And now I'm at 54. So I'm pretty sure this is right. Excuse me. I'm pretty sure we are all good now. And we have all the gold we'll need for a while. And probably need to get some... Uh, get to a um, workbench or something. Anvil. There we go. I'm thinking of New Vegas. What the hell's wrong with my brain? <laughs> oh, jeez. My brain. My brain. Okay. Enemies are displayed on screen differently than friends when you cast detect life or detect dead. I've never really seen that effect, so I wonder. Stray has detect life, so I'll try it on his file. I'm not entirely sure what it looks like. Okay. And go to them. Because I want to finish the entire quest in general, because it also gives them quite a bit of gold. 
They're in the miners' barracks, if I remember correctly. Going, woe is me, we lost the mine, the Forsworn has killed us all. Kolskiger mine is lost, friend. Forsworn killed everyone. It's clear to Forsworn. You drove them off? By yourself? Uh-huh. Thank you. We'll head back to work right away. Take this, it's the least I can do. And... 1250. It's amazing. It's an amazing amount. And it levels with you, so if I was any further in level, it would be 150. I'm pretty sure. Not really tried it. I mean, I remember it usually being 150. Anyway, uh, we will head home, because I want to do this little smithing adventure. That's Riverwood. You son of a bitch. Uh, fuck me. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Uh, the main problem with the 360. Long load times. And the PS3 also suffered from them, so... Uh, it's the main problem with console gaming, I guess I should say. Also, I went out on a limb and found out my new laptop can run New Vegas at ultra high. So, almost kind of sort of want to restart there. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I mean, it'd be cool, but I don't have a peripheral for my controller anyway. So, I mean, I could theoretically get it quickly, but... Eh. It'll take forever. <laughs> Speaking of which, I need a new controller. <laughs> Man, this is taking forever. Oh, boy. Did it just freeze? Yeah, it froze. God damn it. Be right back. Well, that's what happens when you shit-talk your console, apparently. Uh, I'm back now. It took a while. So, yeah. It's, it's a whole thing. It's a whole fucking thing. The Warrior Stone le ability lets you learn combat skills more quickly. I, I had one eye closed when I was trying to read that. <laughs> uh, that was my main problem. Dual wielding potentially doubles melee damage output, but prevents any kind of blocking. Which is really what dual wielding does. In, in all practicality, in like war, it's not very useful. In like a light skirmish or duel, it is very useful. But only in those situations. I might as well unlock this, because fuck it. And now we'll head to the right spot. Friggin' Lakeview Manor. Unless it crashes again. In which case I'm gonna pee all over everything. I don't give a fuck. Jesus Christ. <sighs> the pickpocket skill is used to take things from an unsuspecting target's pockets and not get caught in the process. Scholars assume that generations of living underground rendered the farmer blind. Over time, the other senses have become more acute as a result. Of course, they assume that, but it's not right. It's not true. Hello. And we'll use the smelter now because we're at the right friggin' spot. And smelt all these down. I'll still have a gold ore from Odessi after all of this is done. Good lord. And then some silver, because fuck it, why not? And now we'll forge them all really quickly. Before the episode is done. Yay! Okay, we'll make up that one. Up this one and 
Yeah, I need the flawless ruby, so not that. Hmm. What else? I need the flawless sapphire, too. So we'll make up these. And. Yeah, I'll make up a couple of these. Yep, that'll be good. And the rest, I could probably dump in that. And then golden rings. That'll be good. And that should get me all the way up to 70 or maybe 71 even. With all of this stuff. And one more. Ooh, right on the cusp. But I'm pretty sure I have some leather I can do. And this is just going to give me the notification for 19 years. <laughs> for some reason, it also does it for bars, and it makes no fucking sense. Okay. Deal with all this. There, we we'll call that good. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just give me my notification for my leveling. Damn it. There we go. Jesus Christ. And we'll do all that. There we go. 71. Now, we still have a ways to go. If I go to the right side. We're at 71, and we need to be at 80 for the next set of armor. But, this is good progress. This is good progress. We went up four from that whole entire thing. And there are other ways we can also bring it up further. But we will be doing those in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community and we can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.